and welcome. This is Melissa Armel with a stock swoosh and I'm reviewing Twitter's play of the day, which was Monday. No, actually it wasn't Monday, it was Tuesday. Tuesday was the 19th. Monday the market was closed, Martin Luther King Day. Anyways, Twitter, uh, you know, has been just getting pummeled because of the negative news and such. In fact, I have to look up when the earnings are in this one. I'm definitely going to be watching that when that occurs, which is probably coming up in the next few weeks. But Twitter was a nice short that we got out of and we pulled as much as we could out of it on Tuesday. Again, Tuesday was really like Monday. Go over here. We shorted it, and then we got the drop. And some people got out here. You could have waited for one more push, then it reversed and out. So it was a nice, nice move. You could have gotten not a dollar out of it, but almost a dollar out of it. And again, Tuesday was a very, very slow day. There really wasn't much to look at. Mondays is typically the slowest day of the week, and because Tuesday was after the holiday, it was like a Monday. Uh, but all in all, Twitter is selling off again today, and you have, guess what? The market making new highs. So, you know, I mean, look at this. It looks like we're just headed right up to 3.30 here in the QQQs. And then you look at Twitter, and this is selling off. This did get up today with the market, but the stock is heavy. I just can't see anyone coming in and stepping in here with any institutional money and wanting to buy this for any reason right at this point. While that could happen at some point soon, and again, the earnings are out um, in the next several weeks, you know, right now, people are dumping their stock in Twitter. So it's been a nice short for us. We've done it when we could. We'll see how this ends up in the week. Today is Thursday. Tomorrow is Friday. It'll be interesting to see if this falls and ends up gapping down tomorrow. And if it does, this could end up breaking that level around the 44 area. So we'll see where it goes. If you're interested in learning how to find stocks, play them, and pick the best stocks to go long or short in the day, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. Have a great day, everyone.